Hi, and welcome to iMovie on iPad for Beginners. I'm Michael Cowley, and this movie is designed to help you get started using iMovie on an iPad. To share your movie, tap the arrow coming out of a box in the center at the bottom. I suggest that you tap camera roll because sometimes internet upload can be problematic and camera roll will help you manage this better. Tap an export size such as large. Your movie will be exported and once again this could take a while depending on the length of your movie. Next you will see an export message so tap OK. If you now sync your iPad with the laptop you normally sync with, then, after iTunes has completed syncing, open iPhoto to see the contents of the camera roll on your iPad. By the way, you can sync to a different computer, but you need to be very careful. For example, when it's not the designated laptop for syncing, there'll be a message about the iPad syncing with a different computer, Make sure you don't tick replace or erase. Otherwise, the following steps are the same. Back to syncing your computer with iPhoto open on the screen. Click the movie you've just made. It has a tiny camera in the bottom left corner and click import selected at the top. I suggest you choose Keep Photos. You can find your copied movie in iPhoto's Last Import section. Suggest you drag it onto the desktop to find it easily. It will have a file name in the style img underscore 0328.mov. If you move the cursor over it, a play arrow will appear in the middle so that you can preview it. To find out how big your movie is, in the File menu, in the Finder, click on Get Info. In this example, the movie is nearly 28 megabyte. You can choose how you want to share it. It's too big to email, so copying to USB and giving to someone else is probably most practical. You could publish it on YouTube, and if you use iCloud or similar, then you could save it there. There are books and movies about iMovie on an iPad, so obviously there is a lot more to discover. This is just getting started. Good luck and see you next time.